Hello all, in this session we will see a servlet with JDBC connection. To begin with, we will see what a servlet is. It can be described in many ways depending on the context. It is a technology used to create web application. Servlet is an interface that must be implemented for creating any servlet. Servlet is a class that extends the capabilities of servers and respond to the incoming request. Servlet is a web component that is deployed on the server to create dynamic web page. Next we will see how to create a servlet program. Open NetBeans IDE. Here I am using the version 8.0.2. Now we will create a student management system that gets the detail and marks of the student and updates the same in the database. So let's begin. Go to file, click on new project, choose Java web, web application and click on next. Provide your project name here. Since I am creating a student management system, I will give student management. Now click on next. Click on next and click on finish. Now we could see a HTML page being generated. Now go to the project, right click on the project, click on new and choose servlet. Give your servlet name here. I am giving student details. Give your own package name. I am giving org.student details. Click on next. Choose add information to deployment descriptor and click on finish. Now we could see a Java servlet program being generated. Scroll down and delete the contents below to do. Go to the index page and delete the code and start typing the code for your HTML page. Since I have already typed my code in a notepad, I will copy paste it here. Here I have given form action is equal to student management slash student details. Here student management is the project name and student details is the servlet page. Next I am getting the register number and the marks of five, five subjects from the user. Next go to the servlet page. Since we are we are connecting the servlet with the database we need to import the package import java.sql.star Next we will open MySQL and create a database called student and a table called details. So give the password. Next create database student. Next we will create the table details. Give register number, marks, So now we are done creating the table. Now scroll down in your servlet program and start typing your code in the to-do content. Since I have already typed my code in a notepad, I will copy paste it here.
So here, using request request .get parameter, I'm getting the register number and the marks of five subject. After that, to connect the servlet with the database, I'm declaring three statements: connection statement, result set to null. Inside the try block, I'm declaring the MySQL path. Here, student is the database name, root is the username, and this root is the password. Next, I'm using update statement to update the table inside the values. We are updating the details into the table called details. Finally, I'm printing record inserted statement and catching the exception. Before running your program, go to libraries, right click, select add library and select MySQL JDBC driver and click on add library. Now to run your program, press F6 or click on run. Now the web application is being opened in the web browser. So start typing a register number. And press submit. So now the record is being inserted. Now go to SQL and check if the record is being updated. So now give select star from student. Sorry, select star from details, the table name. So here you could see the record being inserted. So in this way you could create a simple web application using servlet.